Hey folks, and welcome back to Northgard. Let's get this going. Let's spend this episode kind of finishing off our area, I guess I'll call it. Everything our side of this path and this path. The enemy, I'm guessing, is only one more tile there and one more there, unless it surprises me and grows out into something. So we've pretty much explored all of this. And we pretty much cornered the enemy into a smaller space, so we've definitely got the upper hand here. Um, let's let's see, where are we? Uh, where where's our war band? Can I just go to them? I can go to them this way. There they are. All right, you guys, what? Let's send you into here and clean this out for starters. Then we'll uh, use our scouts to explore any ruins that are left and finish off any mining. Okay, watching Green here. He's getting a little bit limited, so is he. Uh, pull out. And let's grab you. No, nope. you. Put you over there. Grab the rest of you. Take him out. All right, you guys over here, we're sitting great on food, so let's go ahead and buy this. That worked, and that is coming now. This is going to become a place to get more lore, which we have some of. Okay, what do we want? Sharp weapons, cartography, um, lore master, Firewood consumption. Firewood is wood is doing great. Don't have to worry about that. Negotiation reduces marketplace prices by 30%. Not going to be doing much buying. We've got all that we need, pretty much. Let's get into this so we can get into these. These are both impressive. Improves your berserkers attack by 50% and increases your military power against defense towers, which we will be going against. Scout was injured. Let's pull him back. That's a practice I do. Grab the scout, send him back here, make you the new scout. And while you're at it, I had a comment reminding me that I missed this one. So let's go let's go clean that one up. Um, we got this done, we did. So more civilians, let's or villagers will go take care of that. Um, let's just kind of I zoom out any further. I am out. You we've got Two people in there collecting lore, lore masters. This is done. These are done. What have we missed in all of our own lands? Are we making the best of what is here? I did send two. There they come. They're going to become lore masters and, and uh, bring the lore in much faster. He or she is exploring that one. Moving our way around and through. Again, we have a lot of food coming in. We've got, we could do that. Build a mine uh, there. Oh good, there is room too. Right there, let's toss somebody into that. Um, probably a house soon. What do we have? Oh, right there. You guys take him out. You three, get ready to get out of there. Do that. Go back in again. Will you take on a new one? Yep, you're not hitting this one anymore. And you're good. Oh, we found a 150 at the uh, ruin over there. And you guys go back in. You guys move on into at least this territory. Eric the Red over here. What are you looking like? Alright, basically house and woodcutting over here. Farming. Town Hall, Training Camp, Scout Camp, Trading Post, they have sheep, they're the Goat Clan, uh, we've got a Shield Bearer over here, Quarry is done, let's, um, let's just put one of you in there, well, not both of you, nope, okay. One of you go back to this one. Thank you. All right. Now, are we concerned? 
Got a berserker over here. War chief, I guess it'd be called. I'm not seeing much else in the way of a military. They may be in there. There's probably one right there. There's a warrior. But we don't have a, a major military to go against us right now. So let's not be too concerned. We want to grab this land here. I've already maxed out over 2,000 again. So let's go ahead and just do that. Let's send you guys against this one. Let's grab this area. We'll send our scout into here. And then we may be just about done with the scout. Alright, we're doing fine here. For the green bars, you need to get out of there. Alright. And our berserker can grab this one for us. His, red, his uh, orange bar has built up again. Otherwise, stop trading wood with us. Hmm. Eric the Red has decided we're not worthy. Okay. That's good to know. We may be, uh, or maybe us expanding this far has triggered something in the AI to say, uh, stop aiding them. You guys, or uh, Scout, go explore that one. Everybody else, where? I'd say a central point between here and here. So we can very easily run and defend if we need to. Otherwise, food is fine. It's so fine that here's how far our relationship is with the giants. We're not going to need the giants, but it'd be interesting to see how this works. Hello. Uh, okay, you guys are going to attack us soon, too. It's not six months away. It's, it's real soon. Two can't click and have it tell me. Is it just two? Ah, oh, there's one over there, too. Alright, let's send War Chief. Whoops. Didn't hit the right click there to that one. And... Alright, I will purposely do it that way so I can get just one. One axe thrower there also. Um, a little further away. Like there. Alright, the rest of you guys. It's the easiest way to get you. Something like that. Uh, who are you? You're, yeah, you're, there you're all of them. Okay, right there. You guys all come down here. And be ready for that. But usually there's four. I feel like I'm missing one. One there. And it's winter. And we're still making gobs of food. I am not seeing a fourth portal. So we're going to go with a three. Okay. Is there any more land that we have not taken? We're all the way into there. There's one more right here. Okay. And that one is access from here, so I guess we'll move in from, from this point. Once this danger is done. Alright, beyond that, we've got three villagers left. Let's build. I'll kind of finish the sentence I was uh, trying to finish. Okay. Uh, scout found gold and, and lore over there. What if we put in a couple more trading posts? There and build there. Alright. Quickly, because we're about to go to war here. You go there, you go there. Hopefully that worked. Alright, so we're about to be attacked right here. You guys are waiting. Good. Took him out, and we're fine there. Let's get over to... You're here somewhere. Probably already done. That's why I don't hear you or see you. Here. Okay. We still have two, 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 and one. All right. All of you, come on over here. And let's go clean up that last war tile, or map tile. Then we'll, we'll think about going to war. I think that's... One of our next steps. Negative two on food in the winter. Okay. Um, we're good here. All right. Conqueror increases your military power against defense towers. That's one of the next things we're going to do, but it'd be nice for that legendary hero, our berserker, to do some serious damage. Is there anything else? Veiled threats, negotiations. Don't need that one. Don't need that one. We're done with, with cartography. This one, we're almost done with this one. Recruitment, recruitment. It'd be nice to get more villagers coming in quicker. All right, we're gonna go this one. 
and I guess we're going that one. Required to achieve the wisdom victory, which we're not doing. So I don't think it actually does anything for us other than give us a victory condition. Um, which is kind of interesting. You don't have to take the victory if you don't want to. That is that is an interesting uh, way of looking at that. Alright, you guys take care of them. Axe throwers, you go over to this side let the let the warriors take them. Alright, we got that. Let's use up some of that food. And colonize. Alright, with that, what else is there to do for our warriors? I'm going to park you guys back over here. Um, I have a feeling we've destroyed the tomb. Okay, that was back over there, and we just survived another year. Okay, I have a feeling that these buildings are done, and they are. Although, it would be nice if I only got one in each and kept a couple of villagers. Where are the other two villagers running from? Right there. Let's save you and put you back. So there's one each, I think. And I want to do something with those. Let's. The whole point is, can we get this going faster? We can. Build our uh, build trade route. Food. Giants. Start trade route. We should see this increasing faster now. I can actually see it moving now. Before it was just crawling along. Unhappy. Okay, why are we unhappy? Tavern's over here. I can put another person in the tavern. Okay, oh, that's, yeah, the tavern. Uh, let's pop another tavern in. Build tavern. You can go in right here in our home base. And house right there. Because that's going to be a, a source of unhappiness, too. And we could even throw a feast. There we go. Um, you're going there. Oh, you are the only one. You're about to pop out another one? No. Mm. Yeah, they're both an issue. Okay. Any more houses not upgraded? Hello. Ah. They're making their move. Pop in here. Grab a civilian. Hello. Guys, let's do this. There we go. Now, any of our people being injured? Doesn't look that way. Uh, tremors will be hitting. Okay. Um, you. That. And E. Go back over here. We'll, we'll deal with them in a bit. Let's take care of those. Alright, did the house get done? The house got done. Let's upgrade you. Costs four stone. Good. We have plenty. And speaking of stone, what's one last project to build? Build you right there. There's iron coming in. Scout, you are done. Let's get you back to any house and and click you into there. And we are doing very well with food. Enough so that I'm thinking about you guys becoming citizens again. That's negative four. Let's put one of you back in. Go with that. It gives us one more uh, villager. To do what? Trade route. I have a feeling the trade works whether you're employed or not. It doesn't seem to indicate otherwise. You're just not gaining as much uh, gold while you're at it. But we don't really need the gold. You know, I've never really sat back and just watched these guys work. Look at that. Stabbing down into the water. Oh, get fish. Oh, got one. Horror. <laughs> and, oh, we're bringing back deer carcasses. Tossing them into the food silo. Pretty nifty. So where are we at now? Let's get this one going. I feel like there's one more building that I threw in. Right over here. Tavern. Just got done. The rest of you guys got to work there. But did that one person still get assigned to here? Let's make sure that, yep, it, it uh, didn't let another one go in. So that is the case. So we should have one villager available now. Food is still, wow, plus six again. And happiness is through the roof. Okay. 
Uh, for that matter, let's just toss in one last house. In fact, let's do it right over here where this is building. And that person will go right over and immediately build it. Okay, economy-wise, I think we've pretty much maxed out. Maybe we'll see this happen. Maybe. Because I want to start uh, harassing Red over here. What I'm thinking about doing... Looking for warriors. You are one. What is that? Construction mine. Oh! Just remind me, we got this coming in. I need three villagers by then, and I do have them. Okay. We've got some iron. Improve. Let's improve you and you. And we're out. Hmm. I need villagers available for when that earthquake hits. But... Can we make another villager in that amount of time? It's possible. It's possible. Food is still crazy. Okay. Let's make another villager out of here. You. Now go there. I got nothing else to spend the food on. Though, just seeing our, our uh, healer over here got me thinking it might be nice to have more healers available when we do fully go to war. Let's think about that. Build a healer where? Right there. And villagers four. We'll put one into there. We're working here. We're working here. And that still leaves three villagers for what's... No, five villagers now. For what is typically five, uh, three buildings caught on fire when we hit that. So once that happens... Is that the new one? No. Where's the new... Healer, where did you, where'd I build you? What was that noise? That's right up there. Let's grab this one. Okay. Anyway, back to you, you guys waiting for this to hit. It's almost there. Where did I build that other healer camp? <laughs> there. All right, two healers in there. Still leaves me with three villagers available to repair buildings. I'm just going to hit any second now. Sheep! Forgot I had four sheep. Let's send you to there. There's our earthquake. Alright, grab villagers. Looking for burning buildings. Right there's one. Right there's one. Okay, heading out this direction. There's one. No, that's theirs. Oh! I hadn't thought about that. The earthquake affects them too. I'm not used to being able to see the enemy's territory. I wonder, when those portals hit us, did they also hit them? And which, I came to the conclusion while editing last episode, that's the reason why um, they lost this land when it was still invisible and that red line went away on the border. I'm going to guess that a portal opened up and took over this and they, they were too weak to come back and defend it. And that's how that land went away. Okay, you're good. That's finished. Looking for burning buildings. Everything's happy. It was one of the farms too, right? Yeah. Well, with that, I think all that's left is to take out these guys. And I think I'm getting toward the end of my time for this episode. But I want to show you the tactic I was going to use. Let's send everybody over here. And for that matter, let's get some more. Let's do that. And you are set to rally, yes. So... It's warriors that we're out of? Oh, I didn't realize that. Well, then let's grab a couple more warriors. Um, upgrade you. And do that. Alright, we got four healers. We've got lots of... Your shield bearers, your axe throwers. Yeah, I meant to get more warriors. I didn't realize I was low on those. Is that everyone? We're waiting for someone to run in. Okay. And she's there. All right. Whoa, winter hit. Which isn't good. You are without a job. You are what? A miner from here. Okay. Then you are now a villager, and this can go away. 
All right. Back to you guys. What I was thinking about doing is just heading in. Rats are becoming. And take out a few and pull out. Hit and runs. Head over here now. All of their soldiers are over here. They're prepared for whatever is going to happen. I'm going to come in here and take out their farmers. Then I'm going to go back over there and take out their woodcutters. And little by little, through attrition, handicap them. Uh, you. Now we are going to take damage from this tower. Eventually you want to take the tower out too. But I can do so much more damage. These guys are all busy on the other side. And pull out. With four healers, they can be healed in pretty much the time that I'm running across to over here again. These guys are, don't know what hit them. They're still thinking about it. Waiting for him, that bar to start going up. I've noticed that the healers tend to all focus on one person at a time. They'll all be healing the same warrior. Let's take you out. And while we have some time left, let's take let's damage this guy pretty good. Then let's get out of here. And head back over here. So that is pretty much what's gonna happen next episode. Until we have uh, taken over our island and move on to what will be a more challenging series afterward. I'm thinking of keeping it at easy. I want to take this in increments so I can see the differences. At easy, but Actually, move you guys to here. Move it up to like three enemies, so there'll be four of us on the same island, but not too difficult. And then, when that one proves something that can be accomplished, then move on to maybe medium with three enemies and see what the difference is there. I think that'd be a good way to, to ramp up this series and kind of get uh, the sense of what this game can do. But let's call this done here. It's been Noble Rambler. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Bye bye.